Thresher sharks can be easily identified by the long upper lobe of their caudal fin. The lobe is nearly equal to their body length. There are three living species of thresher shark. They are globally distributed in tropical and temperate waters. They are mostly seen near the surface, but their depth range depends on the species. Thresher sharks must keep swimming in order to keep oxygenated water flowing over their gills. The largest, called the common thresher, can grow to 20 feet long. A thresher shark's long caudal fin is used to herd and stun schools of fish, which make up most of their diet. They use their tail fin to herd schooling fish like herring by swimming in circles before striking the fish with their tail. Thresher sharks usually strike from above, allowing them to stun multiple fish at a time. They whip their tail at an average speed of 30 miles per hour. Sometimes they hunt in groups or pairs. Despite their strength, thresher sharks are shy and harmless to humans. Their meat and fins have commercial value. Their hides are used for leather, and their liver oil can be processed for vitamins. They are also fished recreationally. Their tails sometimes get caught on hooks after they whip their tail at live bait. One species, the pelagic thresher shark, is listed as endangered. Thresher sharks are ovoviviparous, meaning that embryos receive nourishment from a yolk sac and live birth is given. Females give birth after about nine months. They only have a few young at a time. Size at birth is variable, but newborn thresher sharks are typically about five feet long. Young threshers tend to remain close to the coast. Females grow larger than males. They can live up to 50 years. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.